welcome to detection myth in this session we will see how we can create hello world program in rpgl language as we do in uh, other programming language like java and python so mainly we are uh, going to display one string on output screen so for the same here i have created one program that is hello world and its type is rpgl now we will see the code so i'm opening this program into the uh, edit mode by taking option 2 here i have created sub comment so these are the comment part and below to that i have write star star free it means i'm going to write the complete or fully free format okay so this is not mandatory if like you want to avoid this uh, line then you can do because uh, if uh, you write from this position then it is fine it will consider all the code as free format but uh, for a better understanding i am putting this as star star free now to display the string we will make use of one opcode that is dsply and after that you have to write uh, press space and just write hello world now close the quote and put the semicolon as we do in other language like python uh, in java and c especially okay so from this uh, we can directly uh, display the string onto the uh, output screen now is this completed no it is not completed because in rpg Lee, we have to instruct the program that uh, like we have to instruct the compiler how that uh, here the program will is ended so to do the same what we will do we will turn on one indicator that is star i n l r equals to star on means we are turning on the indicator last record indicator on okay so star i n l r equals to star on this is very mandatory line for all rpg program if you uh, do not include this line then your program will not get compiled okay so now the program is ready for testing and we will call this program and then this uh, string will get displayed on the output screen so to save and exit i will write command file and hit enter now to compile we will take option 14 just hit enter like i have already created this program therefore i am re uh, deleting the existing object and recompiling the object so i am taking option yes why yes hit enter so it is compiled now to call the program what we will do we can directly write call and my program name so my program name is hello world now hit enter uh, it's call c a double -L, l i hit enter so it displays the output on the screen that is hello world so that's what we are expecting from this program and if you want to change the string then you can like if you want to display your name so in place of this you can directly write your name for it now i'm writing it as a shermit now just compile this program by uh, taking option 14 again and you can directly call this program by taking option c in this uh, place in front of that member that you want to call and just hit enter so it will see uh, it will show the same data like shermit because we have stored uh, we have stored this string into display uh, display opcode so that's why we are getting this as an output so yeah that's all for this session in this session mainly we discussed uh, about the basic thing like how we can display a particular string let's say hello world uh, on the output screen using rpgl program so yeah that's all for this session thank you for watching texture